Hi, I'm with Simon Nicholson, who's the social media manager of Honda Motor Europe. Hi, Simon. Hi. How are you today? Very good, thank you. Good. Um, can you tell us what exactly you do in the realm of social media for Honda Europe? So I look after social across the whole region, so the European region. Okay. Um, that's uh, across bikes, uh, power equipment, cars, um, all the Honda products that uh, you can imagine. Um, and it's also making sure that we're integrated across our departments. So uh, look at what we're doing in social, in PR aspects, uh, in marketing aspects, and also customer relations. Right, I see. Um, and how does a brand as big as Honda cover the whole European market in terms of social media? I guess um, that would be um, a mix of central and local. So um, I think it's very important to have that local um, dynamic in your social media um, operations because in, in reality social media is really communication and yep. we're communicating with our customers, with prospects, with our fans. Um, so we need to make sure that they're getting to local Honda so they understand um, what's happening in, say, Honda France or Honda in Spain. So they're getting through to the local people. But it's also put in structures, um, say, strategy, foundation, um, and also technology, which helps those local markets uh, engage. So it's a mix between that localization and mm -hmm. having that tailored local approach, but also having that central um, structure and strategy behind it. And would you say that having a large amount of followers is the most important indicative factor for good social media? Um, I'd, I'd say having a large number of followers um, shows how good your, say, your brand value is or how much you may have spent um, on, um, on advertising for your Facebook page. Mm -hmm. But um, in real terms, it's not the uh, be-all and end-all for social. Um, as I say, social media is really communications. Um, so if we're communicating with people on customer service, then it doesn't really matter to them how many followers we have as long as they have a great customer service at the end of the day. Absolutely. Um, and Absolutely. other things such as, um, say, video reach or awareness. Um, again, you want to be hitting um, a large audience, but you want to be hitting the right people. So it's making sure that your communication is targeted. Um, and a good way to look at it is um, how people were thinking about email lists before. Yep. Um, so you might, you might have a million people on your Facebook page, you say you might have a million people on your email list, but it's how you actually use that million people and interact with them that's important. And just finally before you leave us, uh, could you just give us maybe top three tips to a businessman who's not used social media as to how they can maximise their time and effort, because people do get lost in the world of social media, yeah. spend days on it and not actually achieve a great deal? Yeah, I think the uh, first thing is um, know your company. So really understand what your company is about, um, who your customers are, um, what your products are, the strengths, um, and then, then think about social after that because the core of it is that your communication strategy and uh, how you want to talk to your target audiences. Um, secondly, I think um, when thinking about campaigns, think of them as tied to business goals. So mm -hmm. make sure that um, if you are going to do something on, say, Facebook or Twitter, is, is it tied to that particular business goal? So is it aware, um, raising awareness? Are you bringing more people into your shop or uh, website? Um, are you making more conversions? So making sure when you think of social campaigns, think of campaigns by themselves. And you actually set some milestones yes. that you can actually measure the success yeah. of the and campaign. And that, that would be my third. Make sure you've got um, very clear objectives when, when you go and do a campaign in social. So it's all very good to kind of go along with the hype that we should all have a Facebook page, we all should have a Facebook tab. Yeah. If this tab is going to cost you money to develop, what benefit are you going to get? Um, so make sure that you can tie it to um, quantifiable um, goals at the end of it. That sounds all very good. Thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers.